gonna lie, man. But when that, uh, when the uh, Bolton banner fell, and then they dropped that that stock banner, you you start a little tears in the eye. I had real niggas tears. <laughs> they just poured, man. Was, yeah. When they rolled that, uh, you saw that wolf on there, what the fell? I was like, you know, oh, nigga. Oh, like, when you said the wolf, I mean, yeah. I mean, like, cause we have been through so much with these characters. Man. Yeah, man. Like, but for real though, let me ask you this: Do you sometimes feel like you a star too? I do, man. <laughs> I think we all. <laughs> I swear to God. I, I mean, like, cause when they roll, when that banner rolled out, I'd be like, "We back." Wait, I, on, wait, wait. Was, <laughs> cause I feel like I grew up in Winterfell, man. I mean, <laughs> Truth be told, we really have. Yeah, I mean, we were there, you know, training, uh, moving wood and yeah, shit. Man. And then, you know what I'm saying, like, everything changed. Yeah, Brand got pushed out the window. It basically, yeah. It basically, they got gentrified. You know when white people show up at your door, you got to, that's what happened. Winterfell got gentrified, now everybody want the neighborhood. But we back, <laughs> nigga. We back. Real nigga Goose is back. Them throne, them throne, we ain't never left them alone. Never have them throne, them throne, them throne, we back every week in your home. In your phone, them throne, them throne, them throne, them throne, we ain't never left them alone. Never have. Them throne, them throne, them throne, them throne, coming every week. And your home and your phones. Bro, we back. Ah, we made it. Oh. Ooh. Oh man, Mike. Go do the cabbage pack, <laughs> kill him with the shoulders. Kill him with the shoulders. <laughs> oh man, Mike. We back, son. Battle of the fucking bastards. Oh man. God, yeah, this shit was so epic. That shit was dope, man. It was hey, man. so raw, man. John Snow a fucking beast, man. Man. <laughs> hey, when he took that belt off <laughs> and pulled that sword, I was like, wait, he pulling the he ain't about to serve. Oh, my boy pulled the sword out. Uh, he down as fuck. Oh man. Hey man, how much of that we gonna get into it. But how much of John Snow being a beast on the battlefield is just like regular soldiers said, Oh, I ain't going up there fuck with him. Nah, nah. I mean, <laughs> shit, even Ramsey was like, Oh, you're good. You're good. <laughs> yeah. Ramsey, oh man, Ramsey, go on, man. Woo, so so happy. Glad, Who went out better? Like, would you do you think it was better him or Joffrey? No, Ramsey, man, because Ramsey killed Ramsey was killed by the beast of his own his own creation yeah right yeah yeah uh and but then joffrey went out with the because he had he had talked shit that whole episode yeah i mean he was real bad that episode i was like this motherfucker don't die yeah. and his he had no more words <laughs> you know what yeah. i'm saying i still like the month because see but see man the only thing about ramsey death is i'm disappointed somebody should have cut his dick off man Somebody had, yeah. Yeah, that was, that was funny. <laughs> I, was, I was real upset about that, man. I, I didn't know how they was going to take him out. I thought they was going to flay him. Because I wish he had got flayed, too. Yeah. You know but what I really feel what like, he did to that old I really lady. feel like, I mean, I'm sure the dog probably bit uh, a little bit of his dick. So, but I really feel like somebody should have cut his dick off. I, and let him live for a while. I hate, I hate to say this. I hate to say this, Mike. But I think that... Ramsey had so much control over those dogs that technically he could have called them off. You know what I'm saying? Like he don't, you don't really know. I mean, the only thing we had to say was he hadn't fed them in seven days, mm -hmm. but that don't stop them from being trained. Yeah, but that thing, they weren't gonna let the camera linger on them eating him the whole all the way down to the bone. Like they gave us what we I wanted, wanted to see. I wanted it down to the bone. Like. And they ain't got enough time. If they they do all of that, they got they just got to make an hour and ten minute episode. They show. They probably took about an hour and thirty minutes to eat. Him. Cause that's a lot of you know what I'm saying for a dog. Yeah. For a few dogs, that's a lot of food. They probably had leftovers. You know what was funny about that whole scene was how they probably made some 
Rams and mutton. <laughs> <laughs> Some Rams and chops. Yeah. Uh, yeah, man, that was <laughs> that's crazy. <laughs> I I wonder. Um, I mean, it was just kind of touch and go because, like, what if he had did the little move where he was, you know, how he commanded the dogs to to eat his newborn brother. Yeah, but really, all he do is open the doors. He just don't feed them motherfuckers. Yeah, but they like they they stay in there. Like they don't move till he tell them. That was the only thing, you know. It was just a little, but they hadn't eaten. Even though, you know, I found I found this funny, Mike. Sansa rolled off before he said he hadn't fed him in seven mm -hmm. days. Yeah. So how she know? Yeah. Sansa being Sansa. Yeah. <laughs> that was though. I mean, episode was crazy. Man. It started started out though. You know what I mean? We yeah. was up in Marine. Yeah, let's start from the beginning. Yeah, yeah, let's get in formation, man. They started from, we was in Marine. They were with a dope little shot with the cannonball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With the can like from the, sh the viewpoint of the cannonball. Yeah, right. it was ill. Yeah. Then they came back later and did the same thing with the arrows. Yeah. I, res I respect it. Yes. Yeah. Hey, cinematography this whole episode mm -hmm. was so lit. Yeah, there was some good shots. Damn, I was like, damn, how they shoot that? You know what I mean? Like, Especially when, well, okay, wait, I was about to say, when Jon Snow's in trouble, right? <laughs> like, I, f I, did you lose breath? No, I didn't really lose breath. Really? Nah, I was like, <gasps> yeah, you being a little bit more I was into than I do. I, they put me in it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, all right, we're back. Start from the top, you know what I'm saying? They was bombing, they hit, hit set the cannonballs loose. Yeah. I seen little buddy. He know he wasn't staying woke. He went back like this with the cannonball yeah. in his chest. I bet that felt bad. Yeah, man. Yeah. Oh, oh, it probably cleared up a lot of his sinus problems. It cleared out a lot of stuff. Yeah, including himself. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they uh uh. Then I, I liked how um you know they had the, we got the cool scene with Tyrion and uh and Daenerys, I thought. I thought the way Daenerys walked in that room last week. Yeah, she was where, where all this fuck y'all ain't cleaned up. Yeah, nobody ain't washed the dishes. Yeah, she was, she was mad as mother. She was mad, but she was still, you know, what I'm saying seeking counsel. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So that's cool to see they ain't, she ain't gave up on him yet. You know, uh, and then he made reference to the wildfire. Yeah, that and you had read about. I mean, yeah, you know, yeah, I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah. Sometimes you gotta watch. You gotta it. repent, man. I, I <laughs> 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 the old guys in the new. <laughs> the new guys, man. Shit. Oh <laughs> man, what is red is never red. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever that means. Um. So then you had the uh, you had the three masters came in. They thought they was in charge. How the fuck? How the fuck you think you gonna be in charge? You got three dragons. Bro. Yeah, and they flying around, man. Yeah. You think you just gonna slaughter them? Yeah, man. And then they got the uh, mascara on. They did have mascara. Yeah, man. With the fake eyelashes. What the fuck wrong with them? What they got going on? I don't know, man. That was, and then they had the bronze skin. Like, they got, like, little tan. They probably boots. go to the same shit Trump go to. The tan salon mm -hmm. over there. Yeah, that's what's up, man. Uh, they were, um, you know, they was trying to talk all that shit. Yeah. And then they was like, oh, we came here to get your surrender. Yeah. You stand down, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, and uh, they he, I like how they put the one dude up. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I knew that was that was a that was a uh, bullshit move. We said which one of you should die? Yeah, hold on, I think we're going back to the. Uh, oh, we got the uh, technical difficulties. Yeah. Well, uh, as we clear this up, y'all, uh, it's been a great season with you all. We got one more episode. We riding out to the to the wheels. Well, to the dragons fall off. To the last breaths, uh, all of those good things. Um, what else? What else we doing, Mike? We check doing out it. check out netgooseweed dot com. Uh, also, check for the page, man. We uh, and we're back. <laughs> it's like we just had a Metal Musical commercial. <laughs> yeah, we, we had. Uh, we'll be back after these brief messages. Right, right, all right. So then, um, uh, you know what I like though. I like whenever uh, Daenerys get ready to do like something cool, like when she 
got ready to say, I'm gonna break the wheel, or she knocked that fire over, or like, we finally got to hear her say, Dracaris. Dracaris. I love that word. Uh, but uh, every time that she get ready to do something monumental like that, they play this dope ass sound effect. Mm. And it be and it kinda sound like you on a roller coaster or something, mm. and then like like shit gets so real, like some fire come out. You ever notice that? No. Am I am I paying too much? But I just all the thing I noticed, man, what I was really concentrated on is when she walked into the to the pyramid, right? Uh-huh. Where'd she get a new dress from? Like what? she had took a shower and everything before she got there. Because she was just in a fucking... First of all, she just got off the road. She, she just, just got, got off, the, off the uh, dragon plane. Right. Dragon West. She took a shower, had her hair done, got a new dress, and she had just burned up the motherfuckers. Like she had just been in a fire, really, where they burned off all her clothes. Well, you know what well, that is. That is true. I don't know where that outfit... Well, <laughs> yeah. maybe um, uh, the old oh boy... Uh, the ladies gave her a new outfit? No, nah, I think Dario. Old. The, Probably uh, had her some a Mother's Day gift or something. Yeah, Dario and then Sir Friends on. You know he had something for her. Yeah. Had that fresh things remember outfit mm -hmm. for her. And then uh then she got back to the crib. She was able to, you know, try okay. you know, do a quick little wardrobe bat put her battle gear on, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Changed out of the Chun Lee outfit. Yeah. You know what I mean? And uh she got ready, you know. What I she, like the way uh Drago make his uh wing into stairs. Yeah, that is dope. You know what it look like, right? It yeah. look like he be dabbing because he do. He does. <laughs> <laughs> a dragon dab. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is funny, man. Uh, but this is what I want to know, Mike. Who, who going to be the first rapper to say, I spit hot fire like Khaleesi Dragons? I don't know. Probably, uh, you know who going to be, right? Who's it's going to be uh, Donald Glover. Uh, oh, uh, uh Childish Gambino. Childish Gambino gonna be the one. Yeah. All right. All yeah. right. Or, yeah, him. Okay, I go. With, I go with Lupe. Yeah, Lupe. Lupe, Lupe might do. Yeah, it's Lupe got somebody. Fiasco. Be somebody in both worlds. Yeah. Well, yeah, and that black nerd mm -hmm. kind of cool, you know, backpack rap kind of yeah. stuff. Yeah, that'll be dope. Um, we, but check this out. What you think? Now like you got. They gotta say, I spit hot fire. They be in the booth like Tracaris. <laughs> <laughs> when they walk with the spit hot fire, they be like Tracaris. Or they be like, y'all, uh, y'all thought I was gone, and I fell off the wagon. Now I'm back spitting hot fire like Khaleesi Dragon. Tracaris. <laughs> There's somebody in the background got to add look Tracaris. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be the name of the song. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. We gonna have to bring Drag on back. Wherever he is. I forgot about him. Yeah, he might be the one. This is this his kind of drag on. I don't know what you're doing, but you, need, you might want to take up on that. You Man, know I mean, you think, you don't, you believe drag on ain't smoking crack when they came out with DMX. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think he was. If you were the DMX boys, you probably smoke crack too. Yeah, that's true. Now, or you were the one like, man, stop. All right, fuck it. Pass me one too. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, then uh so we got an interesting conundrum here though, Mike. What you thought about this? So you know how we are. You know what our motto is. Mm -hmm. Oh boy bent the knee and survived. And then the other two masters got their throats slit. Yeah, but What's your thoughts on that? You know what? They he he he's gonna first of all he a bitch anyway. Like he's still yeah, in the realm of bitch. He was just, he got sent back to tell the story mm. of how, but the other oh. thing is, and the other thing is, they made him bend the knee. They, they set him out of there. Nah, like, he kind of like, he bitched out and bent the knee. Yeah. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, but he didn't, but his knee was already bent. Like, they were oh, already yeah, defeated, yeah. you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. He literally bent the knee, but figuratively, you know what I'm saying? He really didn't, because... They made, they said they were like, which, cause they had already surrendered to her basically. Right. I'm glad. I'm glad. Uh, G Dub was like, hey, I know these fans don't want to sit here and watch these niggas fight it out. Mm -hmm. So let me go and slice two of these motherfuckers though, so we can get on to the battle of the bastards. It's, he still keep his <laughs> little um, his his little knife sharp, man. They probably he, he did his thing with that mm -hmm. one. Uh, then we got Theon 
a Theon, Tyrion meetup. Yeah. And then Yara had that game though. Yeah. She was like, "Do you do you want to be on the I don't know, Hey, bitch, I I lick anything." <laughs> <laughs> she was trying to spit at uh, and, and you know, see, that's how they get you, man, right? Cause when she was like, like when the dude is spitting at a girl, mm -hmm. if she don't say leave me alone, you still got a shot. Right. So she might. Yeah, Khaleesi, man, she was like. When she was like, you know, if you, whatever you want to do. And Khalees was like, oh, you so crazy. Right, right, that's right, what, right. That's when right, you know right. you still got a shot. We right. Say, you so crazy. Hey. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey. All right. Game of Thrones, give All us right. that scene that we all want, play. <laughs> All right. What do you think we would get It's going to be a, because it's going to be, you know, go ahead. No, Because, yeah. yeah. you know, they got to bring black girl in there, too. Uh, now you, well, all right, somebody told me that. Yeah, I know what you was going to say. Cause <laughs> see, I don't read, but somebody told me that too, right? That in the book, like, okay, I don't read, but right, somebody told uh, me. Really, one of the Dim Thrones fans told us that in the book. Yeah, they get down. Yeah, Khaleesi and, and Masandra be, you know. They go at it. Yeah, they. We need that same thing. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. You know what I'm saying? Just let us be great. Let them be a Negus. Negus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So, uh, so baby girl got her ships. Mm -hmm. She got three of her dragons. Mm -hmm. uh, she got the, the Dolph Rocky. They rolled through. Yep. R.I.P. to the motherfucking Mardi Gras man. Oh man. Fuck y'all. They gone. They, now was we that, go. they was in the yard hacking motherfuckers up. Damn, too, man. innocent mother uh women and children. I be wondering though, like, if they, the Mardi Gras masks are the masters, how they learn to fight so good against slaves, man. I mean they got the mask, they just hide behind them. And they just like they raw with it. You know what I'm saying? They like they 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 attack in swarms. Yeah, man. But the Dolph Rocket. That's a big ass one. The buck, and then the Dodge Rocket, they, you know, it's like I be scared to fight. I'm not scared to fight anybody. Mm -hmm. But motherfuckers who be hollering when they come in to fight. Oh my God. <laughs> 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 like, oh Lord! <laughs> that shit got, you know, it's got a little psychological element. Yeah, 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 yeah. You yeah. know? But it was like, he was mid cut. He stopped, like, right here. He was like, hell yeah, no! He took off. <laughs> So we could go to New Orleans again. Right. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. No fear. So we'll be there next Mardi Gras. We'll see y'all. Yep, yep. If anybody try to run, run up. Yeah! Exactly. And we on your ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So, and now. And now. So that shit. is the, the Marin part. That yeah, was yeah. Good. Yeah, it was we good. We done with that shit now. Right, we right, on, right. We on to the real shit now. The real shit. Damn. Damn, that shit was so raw. Slow clapping out. <laughs> I mean, standing up. I'm talking, dude, like, man, the hair on the back of my neck standing up. Okay, so, so let's first start from the beginning, right? So they, in their first day, they got all the um, rocks on the checkerboard trying to figure out. Right. The, well, no, before that, they did the confrontation. Yeah. And Sansa came to the meet. You know, I hate Sansa. Yeah. And, you know what I'm saying? Snow, my boy Snow was like, hey man, you really want to set it off? Let me do this shit now, please. See, I got a feeling that Sansa is getting into the Game of Thrones, man. Because, see, really, none of the Snows don't want to fuck with. They, the Snows don't give a fuck about the Iron Throne. They want to be in the North. They want to be at Winterfell. Right. But That's Sansa seems like she got some ulterior motive. She want to win, she want to defeat. I think it's, it's, uh, at first I thought it was just revenge, but now I think Sansa got. I don't even want to talk. I mean, Sansa is finally, I guess, like you want to say she's shedding her naivete, but like she still do dumb stuff. Cause she could, man. All she had to do was say, John, like, okay, don't do it. Don't attack it morning. Yeah, like, hold up. like three thirty. Cause I got my boy Bayless coming through. Right, she never did that. Yeah, man, she let all the wildlings, wildlings get fucked up. She let the sixty-two go. Yeah, 
Uh, I like how Lady Moore, my yeah. little girl, was yeah, there. she was out there, man. She, she, she real with it. Look, yeah, she yeah. real with it, man. She I can fuck with her. You yeah. know what I'm saying? She ten, but fuck. Yeah. I mean, not like that. No, not okay. like that. Wit, wit, sure, not man. her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was thought she was yeah. R. Kelly and nah, nah, I won't pee on her. She's nah, like she'll yeah, grab yeah, your yeah, shit. Yeah. Fuck it up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah. So they go out there to holler at uh hey Ramsey. at Ramsey man Ramsey is an asshole man, man. hey Ramsey got them facial expressions yeah. like golly man they uh, the, one of the things that Game of Thrones is good at is finding a motherfucker who just I don't know if the actor just that good they find evil looking motherfuckers like like Ramsey looks evil he, like Joffrey he, looks evil like yeah. I know Joffrey is an actor, man, but if yeah. I see Joffrey on the street, I, mean, I want to fight him, man. I want to fuck him up. I want to hit him with the baddest sweet I mean, jacket. the real, the actor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah he yeah. could be in, like, jeans and a t-shirt. What you take that role for, a motherfucker, and then you want to sweep him yeah. up, you know? Sweep the leg, man. But uh, Ramsey is, I mean, he was the ultimate bad guy. Yeah. I mean, I, I just, I, I hate to keep bringing Joffrey up, but we didn't think it would get worse than Joffrey. Mm -hmm. And then we met Ramsey. Ramsey is just awful. He done cut Theon dick off. He done stabbed the girl while he having sex. He, he done, done raped Sansa over fed, and over. He again. fed the love of his life to the dogs. Then he fed his little brother. Little brother and stepmama. After minutes after birth. After he killed, he killed his, his daddy. daddy. Oh, what then? I mean, damn. And so, okay. Ramp, but he's so brilliantly evil. Yeah, man. Because he don't give a fuck. Did you see how he did Recon? Polo Recon. Polo First of all, man. Rick. Recon ain't seen boys in the hood. You're supposed to run he in the surface. To get your zigzag game, game on. Come on, man. He went Come out on, like Recon. Ricky. Ricky, Ricky Recon. Yeah. Ah. Uh, uh, Recon! See you. We see you. <laughs> Cause yeah. I was like, I know we kind of gonna zig and zag. Man, this motherfucker ran. That out. motherfucker ain't got no. Hey, was it me or was Recon and Ali the same person? Hmm? They look alike though. They look just alike. <laughs> they might be Recon's brother. Right, right, right. But first of all, if I was Recon, Recon can't fight, man. He should have done. I mean, I don't think he understood, man. He was. But he was right there with. But, I Ramsey. mean, he was a little child. He was probably playing with his little trucks and shit. And then all of a sudden, shit get real. He grown, man. He, tall, he, he look tall as Ramsey right now. Yeah, man, but he ain't really... I mean, it wasn't like Ocean was giving no pussy. No, I'm saying when I'm Ramsey took that hood off him and told him to run, I just fought, fought for mine right there. Nah, nigga. Have. I know what you're going to do. He can't... I nah, mean, nigga. You don't play that game with me. I guess he thought he was going to be able to survive. Not if he ain't running no. That motherfucker ran in a straight line. He ran in a straight line. With like, a motherfucker with arrows on his like he didn't see the arrows. A demented motherfucker with, with arrows. arrows. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see how he shot it first and was like, eh. and then he's like, give me another. Yeah, he was like, he was like judging the wind or something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like oh, I'm so afflicted. Then he shoots another one. The motherfucker just went straight. Damn, he got fucked up. Like, oh my goodness, man. But uh. Uh, what else? Man? Hey, hold up, hold up. So, so we had the the, the meeting with the, with all the chess pieces mm -hmm. after you know the confrontation. Mm -hmm. uh, I like how Ramsey. I mean, how Jon Snow challenged him to the one on one. Mm -hmm. But uh, you would think, man, the Umbers and the Karstars was like trail OGs to the north. For him to deny that, deny the hand to hand fight, like they had to be like, hey, this dude a little bitch. Yeah. But they was really on some I, I pledge allegiance or some shit. Yeah. But they hate the wildness that but I think yeah. that's what that was. Yeah, really but like. you know, man, and see, one of the marks of a real neg goose man mm -hmm. is what a real neg goose do whenever it's about to go down. He, they a real neg goose always say, Won't you fight me one on one? Then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's some real neg goose shit. Made for some real nigga who shit out of his pocket. Like, Won't you fight me one on one then, man? And then and then Rance was like, I see your nigga shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nigga. I heard about you. They be talking about you in these streets. Right. They right. be saying how good you No, you crazy, man. Yeah, like, I, ain't, I ain't stupid, motherfucker. And then so then we had the uh I like our torment 
Tormund, man, he he slowly becoming one of my favorite yeah. characters. And he he's like, did you really think that prick was gonna fight you one on one? Yeah, <laughs> bitch ass niggas ain't gonna fight, son. Huh? And then uh, Tormund gave us the line of the episode: "Happy shitting." <laughs> <laughs> Then man, we find out. I forgot that either I either forgot or I didn't pay attention that Davos, a man, didn't know that um. He ain't know about Shireen. Yeah, man. He did not. This motherfucker just took off walking. Who do that? He ain't got no sleep. I don't. I can't really sleep before important shit either, man. I really remember the. I got. I, 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 and, and, and for real now, I don't know if it's just me and Davos. But I do have, like, when shit about to get hairy, I know shit, so I'm about to go into some real shit. I do have to shit. I mean, I feel, I mean, but does he just keep walking till he shit on himself? Is that what he said? He probably found a nice little spot in the woods, man. <laughs> I just say, I wonder if they have paper, t uh, you know, tissue and... Uh, uh, nah, nah. Eh, yeah. okay, that's bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, mm -hmm. he found the stag. Mm. And at the end, he was mad as fuck. Yeah. Man. So we're gonna find out what he gonna do. Next yeah, man. Cause he didn't know. Like I think it might be curtains for the real. Yeah, reason. man. Cause he was like, you know, I y'all told me y'all was having a barbecue. Right. But y'all didn't told me it was Shireen, baby girl. That's fucked up. And that oh, was his book. see, probably they probably told him like, hey, we are gonna have a barbecue for Shireen. <laughs> <laughs> right, he like of, left off the of part. But yeah, y'all like, fucked up the 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 the, 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 the prepositions, <laughs> goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> Damn man, so he was mad as fuck, man. But I love him as a general. It, like one thing he know how to do is fight and talk. Like he don't really open his mouth yeah. when he talk, and he just like it's like all his words get trapped behind. Him. They have to walk. Right, and right. Have to walk and shoot, and you know what I mean, like. Uh, and then he was like, we might as well be sitting on the shitter. And then, like, I think the the dude who got off the coolest in this whole battle, like, when when Davos pulled his sword out, for some idiotic reason, he got off the horse. Did you notice that? No, I didn't notice that. He got off the horse and took off running. And then it left a dude to hold the horse. I oh, bet yeah. that motherfucker was like, hey. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man, you know I would have been down there with y'all, man, but <laughs> you know I'd be having to hold the horse. <laughs> I mean, if I was down there, you know I'd have been swinging my shit. I'd have been <laughs> killing, but I got to hold the horse, you know. They, I mean, they, I didn't even know Dave Ross was going to get off his horse. Yeah, yet. I thought he was going to stay on, and then but, I was going to run with y'all. Yeah. But, like, but this is a good-ass horse. Yeah, I'm saying, you know Dave Ross be mad by this horse. Yeah, so, so I'm going to stay here. I mean, he bought that horse here on a boat, man, so, you know, I got to hold on to the horse. You ever had to been. deal with a boat horse? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he got all lucky <laughs> yeah, than a motherfucker. Because, man, nobody started piling when they yeah. charged each other, Jon Snow took that sword out. Oh, man, it was so raw. Jon Snow kept getting, getting lucky, too. Yeah. Like, like they was First tough. of all, they, they ran all past him. Yeah. I, put, I don't know if that's luck. I'm telling you that is. Soldier said, hey, he ain't even going over there to fuck. Man. And hey, he got quick. That's part of being, like, take it from me, part of being a good, like, a legendary warrior is... Having good reflexes, no, you feel and hear a motherfucker behind you, creeping mm -hmm. up on you with their sword and shit. Mm -hmm. And then uh, it's like when they when they start hitting each other. I mean, like when they came together, both sides met. I, like all I heard was, "Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the floor." <laughs> you know, motherfuckers. <laughs> hey, man. But so, I don't know if uh, if you out there in viewer land know this, but. Y'all should go look this up. So what happened in that scene in that battle is they basically reenacted how Hannibal mm. beat the Romans. Right. That's right. how Hannibal beat the Romans. He let them attack him and then basically encircled them yep. and did exactly what you saw in that scene. That's a real nigga shit. Yeah. Hannibal, who was an African general, beat the Roman army. Not don't let Hollywood get caught yeah. to that stuff. Yeah, he gonna be Russell Crowe. Right. No, nah, it's gonna be. Uh Colin Firth or some shit. <laughs> nah, the dude that played Captain America. Oh yeah, Chris Hemsworth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
Nah, Chris Hemsworth did Thor. But it'll be him oh, though. Yeah, it'll yeah, be yeah. him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh uh man, that I mean that was so dope. Everything about it was dope. I love the scene. I like the, the cinematography when Jon Snow was like he was kinda looking around and then he tag teamed this one mm. dude and then it looked like he was getting ready to high five the dude. That motherfucker took an arrow through the skull, motherfucker. I'm talking about ain't no more him. <laughs> hey, but boy, uh, Mormont was um uh, was uh, uh not Mormont, but what's the Tormund was uh was swinging this shit too. Now. He was getting it he, in. He a real OG, OG man. But hey, they checked his ass though. Man, tell me this, man. Why they didn't give the fucking giant a sword, man? That's fucked up. Okay. Like, that could have been. Okay, I'm that's, that that could have been. That could have been like. An uh, equalizer, man. And how the fuck the giant don't have no sword? The giant did not have. He had a sword the whole time. Like he was just raw. Yeah, give him a. F it don't even gotta be a Valerian steel, man. And then what about the part where the giant studded? Like he had did some cool shit, mm -hmm. and then he looked at Jon Snow and he was like, "Man, I'm just mad at you." <laughs> and they could have. Melt it down some old rusty. Yeah, I mean, I thought he was gonna be more of a factor. Than he yeah, was. I mean, he did rip that dude in half, mm -hmm. but he had took some blows, motherfucker. But man, he's like, first of all, if I was a giant, I just walked to kick him. Yeah, just kicking him. Like, yeah. why he couldn't do that? He let the arrows come at him, and he was like, Rrr. yeah, he was trying to get his words yeah. out. They ain't really got no real OG training for no for a, a, a giant man. Who would have made the sword though? That would have been a big ass sword. Somebody could have. Whoever made all the motherfuckers other swords. Mm. I mean, he needed something. He I mean, needed like, a shield. The night before. Yeah, exactly. This motherfucker got all the arrows. Yeah, because I'm saying, like, if I was a giant, I'd be. The night before the battle, I'd be like, hey, sir, um, I don't want to tell y'all how to do y'all shit, but. Like, I'm kind of bigger than everybody else. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> I'm a bigger target. So, maybe I should get a shield. Yeah, yeah. And, I mean, like, a sword would be nice. Some. I mean, they could I, they could have like whittled down like a tree or something. Yeah, I could. He could have cut like 50, 60 heads off. Bruh, just yeah, just whipping like a strong whip game. Whip and I mean, they yeah, made them gave him like a big old wooden spike or lance or something like that, man. Yeah, man. I don't look a spear. Or so, the motherfucking giant didn't have no weapons, man. They play him weak, man. Cause every time he ran, it's like he ran in slow motion. That's how they do a real niggas, man. Yeah, man. They should. They could have done him a little better. Uh, but they got torn. I like how torn. All right. So when the giant did do something, like he kind of pushed through the mm. uh, through the trap that they had set. Mm. And then, uh, then Tormund went in. He that shit was so cool. He ripped the shield down. <laughs> Beat the shit out of this motherfucker. <laughs> With then, your shield. Yeah, yeah. And then, then, then they gave him a wake up call. Yeah. Like, hey, motherfucker. And then, then they pulled him back. And it was like, yeah, man, we need you. You're, you're important to the yeah. plot. Yeah. But I'll die. Yeah. And then, dude, got <laughs> you are the wildie. Right. And so then, like, Torment was like, all right. So we surrounded on all man. Them bodies were stacking. Yeah, like, man. And they surrounded on this side. We surrounded on this side. Let's go this way. Let's go out the back way. Mm -hmm. And then that's when they met that Umber dude. That Umber dude looked cool as fuck because he gave that dope ass speech before they charged. I don't know what he was saying. Yeah. He was, whatever he said, he said it with sincerity. Yeah, yeah. And then I like, man, I like when Ramsey was like, knock, draw, <laughs> shoot. And then the arrows went flying, man. I was like, Damn! I had forgot who I was rooting for yeah. for a second. Like, Not me, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm always that with my phone. <laughs> and then, um, so then, Tormund and meet the uh, meet the uh, Umber dude. Yeah. And it's like the battle of the beards. Yeah. So they <laughs> fight, and then we hear the horn, motherfucking knights of the veil come out. But the Umber dude was like, "Hey, man, what the fuck going on? Like, why y'all stop?" Tormund didn't stop. I, I've been telling y'all for weeks, I've been saying to be stuck, I don't know if I said it on Dim Thrones or not, that it's going to be the same scene as when Stannis came and saved um, the saved Jon Snow when the Wilders was about to kill him. Yeah. When they did this. Then they came, yeah. yeah. It was the same thing, man. I knew I saw it happening. 
I, the only mistake I had was I thought it was going to be uh, the Black Fishes on me. Yeah, I thought, I mean, but, and I, I thought Brienne was going to be in it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because she would have came up and seen Tormund rip that motherfucking neck out. Yeah, would have. She was, they would have had to put a pan under the Yeah, was, yeah, they would have fucked so right there. Like, yeah, yeah like, oh, <laughs> I didn't know you had that move in your repertoire. Eat me. And then would be like, damn, Game of Thrones after dark. <laughs> 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 oh, man, but yeah, so the Knights of the Veil vale came through yeah. on the cavalry side of the game. And So uh, what, they, like Sansa went to meet them? or? Yeah, man, Sansa was on that bullshit, man. That was fucked up. Cause, cause, at first, you know, Jon Snow was like, you know, Sansa, you ain't gotta be here. Yeah, she was like, no, I want to be here. <laughs> and I was like, okay, tell this motherfucker something. Yeah, tell him to hold up. Give him some intelligence. What if she they came like? Cause if they would have come, like forty five minutes later, man, no, they'd have been too late. Right, right, man, look. And Recon could have survived. Yeah. I think Recon would have lived. Yeah. If they would have come earlier. Yeah, because cause they came from the back. And then... Because I, th- I feel like one of the veil or either Peter Bailey would say, Hey! Zigzag, motherfucker! Right, so... <laughs> what? Step your... <laughs> step your East-West game up, nigga. Yeah, man. <laughs> you just brought south of it all the way here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. And, uh... So so they came through, um, but but this is the thing about Sansa is like Sansa was sitting on this intelligence. She was challenging Jon Snow. It was like, look, I might have something to include. Yeah. And then Jon Snow was like, all right, bitch, what the fuck you got to say? Yeah. She ain't had nothing. You had a whole fucking army. I'd be, I'd be mad if I was Jon Snow. I would be mad. If, like you, uh, you'd be mad, but you'd be kind of glad because you did. Cause she could did come through. Right, cause they was hey, it was curtains. Mm. I don't know. Like so, what was happening? So when, when like that's like right, if you with your boys and you get jumped and they let them beat you up for a while. Yeah. And then they come through. Right. <laughs> yeah. Right, you know right, what I'm right. Like hey, so why y'all? Yeah. Like, why are you just getting the yeah. guns and the and yeah. the baseball bats and shit with the barbed wire? You knew yeah. that shit was in the trunk. Yeah. <laughs> I got my ass towed to shreds. My little brother, they got murked out. You know what I mean? Yeah. But when you think about the plot, like he kind of had to die because then, like, what would Sansa do? Because he, because he's a male child. Yeah, she would have been. He would have been. Plus, man, see, you she, knew Recon was gonna die. Because he was so expendable. Like, he was the only Starks really nobody gave a fuck about. Yeah, it was like, oh, they do have a younger son. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The one that now, didn't if they get did that shit to the Brandon, way. man, I probably wouldn't have been on this show for a couple of weeks, man. Oh, yeah, I would have rocked. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I would have rocked. I would have yeah. went. I'd have had, I'd been wearing this shit. Yeah, I'd have been wearing all black. Yeah. For a couple of weeks, man. Shit, we damn near riding when the damn uh, White Walkers came. Yeah, man, there. bad as you felt about Hodor. Yeah. If that was Brandon. Yeah. Shh. Yeah, it was right. <laughs> They'd have had to answer some questions. That's how I cuss. <laughs> On the level. <laughs> you kill our little cousin, man. <laughs> like, that's, like, that's that one cousin. Like, you just see her in the summertime. Yeah. But if somebody fuck with him. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. right, 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 right. Don't be fucking like, with our cousin. Only I can fuck with her, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, so then, uh, so when the Knights of the Veil vale came, Ramsey had to look like, I mean, his fa- he needs some kind of award just for his facial expression. Mm-hmm. Like, he was so conniving how he sent everybody into the battle, and he just kept backing Yeah. Up. He backed all the way up till the knights came, and he was like, hmm, this shit is kind of over. And then he takes off running back to Winterfell. And John, John being- No, he take off on the horse, right? Yeah, yeah, on the horse, yeah. yeah. And then and John, John Snow keeping up bloody, with him. Bloody, bloody tired. He got to be tired. Tired. That like, he was running like hell, boy. Man, and the, him, the giant, like. And then the Sasha giant... standing there watching him. And why nobody ever came and said, hey, the dude who was holding Davos' horse could have at least ran up nah, again. That motherfucker was back at the crib, like, thanking God. Yeah. 
calling the hoes over, you know what I'm saying? Like, look, you know, I fought in this badass battle. <laughs> I was the only one that survived, you know what I'm saying? You probably love her and didn't know the lawyers of the bill came. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, wait a minute, that's not how it ended. Uh, uh, what? What are you talking about? <laughs> like, <laughs> like Jimmy Fox said, who they almost got us. <laughs> <laughs> but I got away, though. <laughs> But uh, man, so like, why the giant? The giant could have picked up Torment and Jon Snow and put him mm -hmm. on his shoulders or some shit as they ran. Yeah. Or like ran with him like this. Like the giants do that. Mm, I don't and, know. Yeah, and then I mean, all the giants I know don't do that. Right. And so then I I like how so the CGI was on point this whole episode, but when he bust through that door, his hand was a little small. Like. like uh -huh. it, the giant had a regular size hand. Because <laughs> they shot they shot the arrow through. He probably got like a lot of splinters in his hands. Man, that motherfucker had all the arrows. <laughs> I'm talking. This motherfucker walked through the door, Mike. I said, damn, does he have there any arrows left? <laughs> hey man. How is he still? I know that shit right, cause like I'd rather somebody literally stab me. They yeah. stick me with a uh, uh, a stick pin. Or yeah, something yeah, like yeah, that. yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit had to be aggravated as fuck, man. Okay, he was. That's why he. That's why he was moving. That slow. shit was. But it was. Might have been. It might have felt like um, acupuncture. It might. I mean, this one. <laughs> he walked through. He looked like the he, old Legion of Doom. He looked like Pinhead. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he like the old little fabric. Little and they weren't trying to shoot him nowhere in the body, just all up here. I mean, damn, man, he had all. And the then what? Make me see. This is the thing. They ain't get. They really didn't give that giant any military training. They did. Cause you know what could have stopped all that? All of those arrows and shit. What? This. That's it. <laughs> That's all he thinks. But when they shot him in the hand. Like, he pulled his hand back and the arrow just slid through. Yeah. It was so gross. Yeah, but she, all he had to do was this. So when he do that, I mean, like, listen. I he, bet you when Jon Snow, like when Ramsey was shooting those arrows at Jon Snow, uh -huh. I bet the giant was like, damn, I could have did that. But he could, well, he, you remember he picked it up mm -hmm. and was slanging motherfuckers with it. But it looked like he could have just jumped up and, like, cleared off that whole yeah. shelf of arches. You know what I'm saying? I was kind of mad he did, you know. Yeah, but man. that scene. But maybe, maybe Giants. Well, he probably was slow, man. Man, he um, probably had like learning disability. He was, uh, he was at least on the autism spectrum. Uh, <laughs> I mean, he was the oldest person because, on the show. Yeah, he couldn't talk, man. Yeah, he was the oldest person on the show. He had like. Man, I mean, but that's what I'm saying. Like, you the oldest person on the show. I know you didn't seen some combat. Yeah, because but you got to think about it. But he when they asked the real it. nuanced question of what he thinks, the, should the wildlings align themselves with the snows and go fight the other people to take back the north? His answer was, no. <laughs> so, you know. <laughs> yeah, it was only so many words he yeah. could have got out. And then he go and look at Jon Snow. And it looked like he was like, hey, man, you know, I gave it up. I gave it all I had. And he didn't even get to say that because Ramsey shot like the most perfect bullseye through that nigga eye, man. I was like, Ramsey was an asshole. He was such an asshole. So then. Like, he ain't got no good in him. No. Like, good. he don't even got no compassion for <laughs> <laughs> I was man. like, damn. Ramsey is all asshole. All and then he's like, you know what? I reconsidered it. <laughs> and then he pulled out that pulled out that bow and arrow and John so picked that that uh that shield, shield up. up. He walked him he did down, it. Mike. Yeah. That shit was so raw. Yeah. Except that it made me wonder like he was right up on Jon Snow and Jon Snow the arrows was going a little bit into the shield. Yeah. Recon was far away and that shit went all the way through his body. That is true. But well, I don't know. I don't know about that one. I mean, because you got to add in gravity. You got to add in. Yeah, I'm sure you've done the math. Okay. Yeah, you got to do the space-time continuum. Yeah. You got to put in Pythagoras and theorem. Yeah, and then and the uh, <laughs> rotation of the Earth. You got to use acute angle versus obtuse angles. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You got to have, like, you know, just a strong yeah. uh, math. I go in there somewhere. Somewhere, you know what I'm saying? Uh, but all we know is he got on top of this one. I thought he was going to beat him to death at first. Mike, like, I I think I swung one of the punches. 
Did you like? Did you stand over? My hands were hurting, man. Cause like I like I pushed his elbow. I said push, punch like punch harder. Like I was like, I was in it. I but you know I I wanted him to stop. Why? Cause I wanted them to cut Ramsey dick off. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still ups a little bit upset that they didn't cut his dick off, man. Yeah, maybe I mean maybe the the dogs bit it off. Yeah, but I mean they'll be on Game of Thrones after dark. Yeah. <laughs> After Brienne. Right. <laughs> and now the main event. <laughs> the moment we've all been waiting for. <laughs> but uh so he beat the shit out of him. Like, oh I was so happy. I was so happy. And then he woke up and with his last little asshole in him. What did he tell Sons? First of all, we forgot the whole part at the beginning. Like, he what started us. He kept calling John the bastard. <laughs> what are you calling him the bastard? I mean, at the beginning of the. Oh, whole he show, said. Uh, he started out the whole episode. It's like, been an asshole, man. Yeah, he's and like, he went out of asshole. I pardon you for leaving the uh, Night's Watch. You know, you talking about that part? Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. But the end, though. Yeah. Did, he, did you see what he left us with? What? He skeeted in Sunset. <laughs> Sunset's got that baby on. Did you catch that part? I didn't catch that. Remember he said, you can kill me, but I'll always be with you. Yeah. They sound so pregnant. It sounds so like you're pregnant. Because it really, like in the, in the span of the show, that was really at the beginning of the season, but that really wasn't over like three, four days. But he raped the shit out of her. Though. That's what I'm saying. Really, that was like three, four days ago in the real time of the oh. show. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He yeah. raped her, and then she ran away. And ran the window. I mean, to the to the, to the, to the wall. wall. Yeah. And did and and John Snow, cause that was like three four days ago, uh, maybe about two weeks. Uh, I and get the one. Get, I get yeah. the one. Yeah. It ain't no really. And like, she probably couldn't get. Nah, less than a month. Man. But nah, cause think about it. Like she been like real angry like this whole season. Mm -hmm. So she ain't had a period. Yet. Yeah. And then remember she told. I can't believe I just said that. <laughs> I can't believe I just listened to it. <laughs> they got a valid point. <laughs> I hope the ladies don't. Uh, lo uh, lords and ladies, leave us alone on that point. But remember, she was told uh, Baelish that she could feel him inside her. Yeah, you, you examining that shit real close, sir. Man, she got. Because I know Sansa do. St I mean, it's like for all the stupid shit Sansa do and all the naive stuff she do, it's still stuff that has happened to her that, like, like it's just beyond. Yeah, she her kept control. reiterating all season that she could feel him inside her. She got a baby on. I thought that might just meant that Ramsey had a big dick. No. I no. No. Well, maybe, man. Maybe Sansa pregnant. Let's let's hope that the Sansa's tragic. At least she back in Winterfell. At least she back they in the They go bury in the in the uh, in the crib next to my father, who hey, is technically not his father. Yeah, so <laughs> Ned isn't buried there. Nah, he is. Remember they shipped the body. Yeah, back. they. Uh, so Rob isn't buried there. Rob is not. Buried. Yeah, they. You yeah. they sent him out on the. Uh, yeah, yeah. I don't, I, don't, I don't know what they did with Rob. You remember? They, I think they sent him out on the water, and then then they shoot the arrow. I thought that was somebody else. Maybe. I think it was because Catelyn Stark was at that one when they shot the arrow out. Oh, yeah, because you know she did well. Might be dead. Yeah. Down the mother. <laughs> I don't. Be, I still don't believe the Blackfish is dead. I do not believe anybody when they don't no. show their death is dead, man. Nah, Blackfish. Uh, I mean, they don't have no point in keeping him around. Like, yeah, they have no character development. His army, man. He got an army. He got an army. He can he lead an army no, out of nowhere. The Tullys got an army. Yeah. And that old boy went back and took it over. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, I don't know what's going to happen with that. Yeah. Uh, and then, uh, so, you know, we all, we at the season finale now. We ain't seen Dorn since the end of the season. Right, we ain't seen Dorn. We only saw Brandon. We hadn't really seen Brandon since right after, you know, Hordor died, man. Right. And what was that like? Three, four episodes. Ago. Yeah, man. But they showed him in the preview for next week, so I, I wonder what 
What's going yeah, on? Been, there? You know that girl been dragging them a long time. Yeah, old girl about to die as fuck. Well, no, now they with Benjamin. They got Benjamin now. Oh yeah. Yeah, and uh, so uh, what was the other thing? And I, he might hit the wall. He might hit the wall, mm -hmm. and if he hit the wall and he still got that mark on him, will the Ice King find him? And then that's how he find what the Bluetooth. He got Ice King Bluetooth. Yeah. It might, man. It might. He got the DNA on him, so he gonna do some. But the, I think the Ice King, the Night King, knows where the wall is anyway. Oh, I don't know. I mean, he's just been kind of wondering through the, you know. Uh, so finally, we got. Uh, I don't think so. I mean, I don't think Daenerys gonna be in the season for now. She might. Yeah, I think they 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 talk, Really, they've already tied up. Right. Her I mean, storyline. Then she just got because they gotta just wait for some ships to be built. Yeah. Well, they got the hundred. Yeah, from, but they uh, need you know. Yeah, they need a little bit more. Yeah, they got. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So I mean, cause a hundred ships like the motherfucking, the motherfucking between the fucking unsullied, and the. And the uh, cop, the uh, cows, they can't fit on. Uh, nah, and then the horses and everything. Yeah, yeah, because they, they need the horses. Yeah. Uh, so, but just hopefully she had the West now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, cause that that's gonna be a dope. I can't wait to see how the cows handle Westeros. You know what I'm saying? Like how they gonna roll through like the Riverlands yeah. and shit with those horses? You know what I mean? Like they finna cut mother. Yeah, yeah, they go to yeah, they finna be out. But then they might they ain't gonna come to the north though, cause they used to the desert. Yeah, yeah. they, they can't go to so. the north without no shirt. Cause they don't never have no shirt. So yeah, yeah, they'll get fucked up. They gonna need some. Uh, and the unsullied, they really wear just basically the muscle shirts. Yeah, yeah, the little tank short down. sleeves. So yeah, they gonna have to get some whole new. Sh they gonna have to stop at like a CVS where Sansa got her pregnancy test and right. get some like uh, <laughs> <laughs> some thermal shirts. Oh man, I hope uh, I hope that Arya is able to make it to one of them. Oh man, that's gonna be yeah. If and, and everything could, be okay. Yeah, cause she said she was going home. Man. She did say she was going home, and she gonna what a pleasant surprise when she yeah. home. Like, I I just hope that she able to make it. Like, don't nah, she gonna be sad too, cause, cause cause Recon did man. She don't know. Does she know that? Oh, she knows that Rob is dead. Yeah, she knows she about, about Rob. She, about she was really family. yeah. She was right around the corner from Rob. Yeah. I don't think she knows Sansa's still she, alive. Hmm? I don't think she knows Sansa's still alive. Yeah, she don't know that. Well, no, she might, because remember she bought into Brienne. Well, she, yeah, and also, like, there's no reason for her to think Sansa's dead, because she really thought Sansa was down with Jeffrey. Oh, that's true. You that's know, Joffrey, when she true. left. She just murked out after they killed her daddy, but she knew Sansa was straight. Yeah. Um. So she really don't have any idea. No reason to worry about Sansa. Yeah. So does this mean? And then when she when they tell about recon, she was like, "Damn, I did have another brother." Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then I wonder if Bran makes it back through the wall, even though he got the little uh, Bluetooth on him. Mm -hmm. Like, if he was able to make it to Winterfell, I mean, I, the way Game of Thrones set up, but see, he going made north, it, man. Huh? He going north. But he, he already going north. south to the wall, remember? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. But he, he got to go the... past the wall, and they're going to probably tell him, like, your brother already done left. Man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, uh, I guess, man, next week, season finale. Yeah. Uh, We're going to have Sansa a baby shower. Yeah. We're going to do that. Yeah, you know, uh, Arya, she said she was going west of Westeros, so she coming over here probably. Yeah, yeah. But we ain't got the Raven yet, but I'm just assuming. Right, right. Well, we got we got our, uh, we got our loyal audience. Y'all tweet her and tell her that west of Westeros is the real Nate Goose. Mm -hmm. Come check us out. Uh, do that for us, man. We might uh, do something for you. Yeah. All right, don't forget to like, share, comment, and repeat. Yeah. And subscribe to the channel. Them thrones. Them thrones. Them thrones. Them thrones. You see why we can't leave them alone. We just can't. Peace. Peace. <laughs>